Hey guys, it's Monday afternoon and I've got meetings set up with Andrew Flair at his new home we're building for him. It's been several weeks since I've met him on the job site. We've had a lot of things have been done, sliding glass doors. We started building upstairs above the garage. So he is meeting me here just to get up to speed and most likely he'll probably come up with some changes for me. So I'm, uh, I'm ready for that as I always am. So stay tuned, I think you're gonna like it. Okay, just got here at Andrews. I can hear him inside. He's walking around getting a jump start on me, but I brought him a little gift from uh, my uh, remodeled rental house. I wanna see if he knows what this is. I think it's a family instrument for the flares. I'm sure they, they played the washboard at some time back in history. So let's see if he knows what it is. I'm sure he can play it. If he can't play it, I'm sure he can do some laundry on this thing. So I gotta see where Flair's at. It's a big house. You can hide in a few spots in this place. We got the front doors on. We got them all protected so we don't want anybody going through them. So we left the window out, I guess. So this is the way in. Oh. Andrew! Where'd he go? Shit! There he is! Hey, Andrew! What's up? What are you thinking here so far? How are you? Good, man. This so, is crazy. Uh, there's a lot. A lot to see. There's a there? lot, yeah. yeah. I haven't been here for a while. So we'll walk through the whole house and see. We got a couple windows missing. I see our, our front door is now a window. Yeah, like, yeah. We got it all boarded up because those doors are the finished doors. Oh, so I see. You don't want them getting banged we up. Don't want to, and if we take them off, it's because it's three point locking system. It's kind of complicated. So mm. for now, we're going to leave them in place got so it. we build a house around it. But I brought you a little gift, Andrew. So. I figured this is a family instrument from the Flair house. Really? You could, it's either, you have to tell me if your family does laundry on this, or is this part of an instrument that you would, when you had your get togethers back in the Flair days? I've, you, I've you've never seen one? No, I have oh, no idea what this maybe is. Your, maybe it's your dad. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't, I'm not yeah, sure what this is. The old, uh, the old days where they'd sit around out in the country, since you're a country boy, I figured for sure, it's either someone's playing the spoons, <laughs> someone's playing the washboards, yeah, yeah. and someone's playing the jug. Going, okay. <laughs> So, really? so this is not your instrument. So no, I've never seen you're gonna have to use it for laundry then. Okay. We'll do so laundry, you, so. is that you just? So I, my, uh, I found this in my uh, rental house that ah, we're doing down under the steps. Yeah, yeah. And uh, along with that, we thought we found a million dollars, but it was a, a horn of all things. Uh, a horn. Yeah, a that's horn. For, fitting. Yeah. That's for him. Yeah. I, I was. I was. You were more excited than the I million was, bucks. I was really actually more excited for the million bucks. Oh, than okay. The horn was more like, but the horn's very fitting. Yeah, but it works. Yeah. Works it, so. Nice. So let's go through. Uh, is yeah, there a certain place you want? I say, what's what's new besides well, everything? Well, all your sliding glass doors are in, and typically, you'll see how these pull from this direction. Oh, okay. And there's a reason for that: is that you get your table sitting here, you don't have to walk all around your table to go out. So, putting the doors here that makes sense. is the kind of the shortcut. Yeah, going out to the deck. So, nice. the deck material has been selected. So okay. that's the next thing. We have to put this. Remember this bladder system? Yeah, in. yeah, yeah, yeah. So underneath, we put the deck on, so we can also finish the underside which makes it look really nice. So mm. the old days you'd look up at most decks and you see all the uh, the floor joists, yeah, yeah. bird nests, wasp nests, that will go away. Sweet, right. I yeah. love that. So That's awesome. uh, we'll stay on the main floor for now. So it looks pretty much the same. Um, we're still waiting on, on the fireplace and a couple of windows. Yep. But let, let's go downstairs and look at your, that big Nana wall. That oh yeah. Putting, all right. Let's yeah, I haven't, I haven't seen that yet. So it looks like the HVAC guys have been doing stuff. They're here. So, uh, matter of fact, our next meeting will be with you as we'll meet the electrician here probably next week. Okay. Are, are you around for that? Yeah, yeah, I'll be around. Okay. So that, that takes about almost a, a, a good solid half day, if not longer. We'll, really? We walk through the entire house, lay the plan out, and we figure out where all the can lights going to go, oh, even though it's on the plan. Smokes. So you got to, if you got extra, uh, Thoughts, okay. maybe be thinking about yeah, yeah. outlets, right. Christmas trees. I'll help you with all Okay, all good. Those I, need, so, I need all the help I can get. So let's go over here. Check this out. These doors are now in. Remember that we had windows and we had to grind everything yep. out and, yep. and get this. And now you have French doors nice. going that. out underneath the main deck. And that's on both sides. Yep. This that's is sweet. a big custom glass wall we got to build yet. And so. And when's that, when's that happen? Uh, that'll be towards the end. Towards the end. Towards the end. Because you don't want it to get all dinged and up. And that and it, it's got to be measured perfectly 
likely for the opening, mm. we might lower some stuff down. Got it. So you have this huge 10 foot high ceilings. We might make it a nine foot tall door. Got it. Kind of so it matches your nano wall. That's yeah. nine foot. Okay. Wow, this so, is cool. So if I told you that these doors, they came in, they were sliding from here. I, I changed them around. Oh, so, okay. Because they, they all, I just all I just took that door, moved it here and that one. Oh. So the idea is that when this one pulls back and then this one pulls back, all right. You take your nano wall on this side. Have you opened this up yet? No, I haven't. Haven't you? So you got these levers okay. right here, right? That's just simple lock. Nice. Got this little handle. I don't have those on my house. That's, no. a, that's a new addition. Oh, okay. Well, for 25 grand, you should have a handle. Did, I, did you know that's what the <laughs> wall No, was? I didn't know that's what it cost. Oh. I'm glad. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> the, the, I'm gonna, blaming the wife on that Yeah, one. yeah. Well, I should tell Macy. She's doing Yeesh. a great job with the budget. Yeah, she isn't. <laughs> so <laughs> so $25,000. All right. I mean, yeah. it's a cool door. Yeah, but, but man, those it are is cool. It's it is cool, isn't it? Yeah. So if you stand back, you imagine that'll be your bar. We'll have all this closed in. So Glass, now yeah. this is your indoor outdoor room. You can see now why I changed the yeah, doors. Yeah, now it's more open. So right? this will have a look of like a column. All this opens up. You can go to the deck. Yep. You can go to that underneath that. Yeah, Not the deck, one, but that, on makes, the patio. that makes sense. Aren't these these They're things sweet. impressive? Aren't they? Yeah, it'll be cool to have indoor outdoor. Here, maybe a swimming pool or something. People can kind of come and go and have a chat and go to the bar, get a drink, go back out. Yeah. It doesn't feel like you're having to like walk through the house and back out. It's one big open yeah, area. Yeah, if you've thought this out on your plan together that when they are coming in and out of the house, yeah. they're looking for shade. Yep. This will have its own heating and cooling system. So yep. you can do it on football Sundays. Yep. But they're also looking for shade, something to drink, a place to hang out, but also a bathroom. Yep. And your bathroom is right around this corner. Nice. So this doubles as a place they're gonna come with their friends and yep. coolers and sometimes backpacks and towels. Yep, yep. That will be the pool mudroom. Oh. Where they okay. drop all their yeah, stuff. I like that. You can't see it, and then they go into the bathroom. That makes sense. And then from here, you go in this back hallway. Yep. Takes you into under the garage, the big sports court. Yeah. Room. We're still trying to figure out. Oh, do you, out. you, you want to hear Macy's idea? Yeah. What's it going to be? She said she. You've been to the children's museum? Not right lately. So at the children's museum, you would have like an area that's like a doctor's office, a grocery store, an oh, auto mechanics for kids. For kids. And oh. so she wants like a ball pit a doctor's office, a grocery store, like full on operational, like it's a mini town. Just a little town. A town. Oh. She said that and I, I'm like sports court or mini children's village. Oh my God. Well, you saw, but I, did you I, saw. there's no way I'm going to win that argument. Cause you, I saw the, I saw the play, the playhouse you made. That's yeah. what made her, I'm blaming you. Oh my she God. She saw that and she goes, why don't we just take that idea and put it in our giant sports court and have, she's like, you ever been to the children's museum? I'm like, yeah. She's like, I want that. So. Okay. Yeah, a little. Town. I'm up for that. I'm up you for the challenge. You are up for it. Yeah. Okay. So you, I don't know where do you start on how you. Everything's got to be small. Small. Every like she already bought. She, there was Amazon was having Prime sales. Unfortunately, yeah. she already bought like a couple thousand dollars worth of, like play food for the grocery store. She's already ready. Rich. Okay. Yeah. There's like a so mailman, got, police station. Guys, well, then you can drive those little cars. Cars. Yeah. You can drive. Yeah. Around. Yeah, I want to live stuff. under your garage. I know. I, I know. wanted to be your dog a couple <laughs> weeks ago. Now I want to be. Uh, you want to be a kid yeah, at, be a the, kid. at the store. Exactly. Yeah. So that's what we're thinking. Uh, you, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, I know where my grandkids are going to. Yeah, I say this will yeah. be the playhouse, basically. Jeez, yeah. Mike, that would be awesome. That's a great idea. I think it'll be cool. It'll right. be cool. The kids, it, the kids are. That's priority. So we got to make sure they're happy. Yeah. So. And well, you're out here in the country. I mean, there's no really streets so they can ride, ride their bikes around. Yeah. And... So that's that's it. That's their their, their whole town, their village. Instead of Whoville, we'll just call this Flairville. Yeah. All right. right. That's good. So it's kind of at a stage again that the HVAC, you see some of the stuff hanging down. Yeah. These guys are about probably 80% done. We still have to nice. figure out above the garage upstairs. Got we, it. we should go up there and yeah, I we can need to show check you. That out. We've framed out that elevator and we've we're, uh, we've created the storage space. Yeah, for above it. the kitchen, right? Yes, Near yeah. the kitchen. So let's let's cool. go up and is that where we're gonna yeah, go next? Yeah, let's go. All right. All right, Andrew. So you can you can see we get your doors. We're yeah. starting to button up the place Looking a little good. bit more, right? So we're out in the garage. Last time we were here, I don't know if you've seen the steps. No, no I haven't seen. Done. I haven't seen them. This is crazy. So I mean, you would think. I mean, it's a big staircase. You know, we did have it at that end. Right? I'm so glad we moved it over and here. It's, That's it's, so much more convenient to go to than to walk all the way across around all the cars. This is a good call. Agreed. Yeah. So yeah. sometimes a plan doesn't always work. That you have to keep working the plans. What I say, right? Yeah. Love it. So by the way these stairs go up, you know nothing goes down. We created a ton of storage for yeah. you underneath the steps. So Sweet. it goes all the way back and around. I don't know what would you put in here. There's always something. 
Yeah. Could be kids' bikes, could be Christmas lights, could be whatever. Well, I guess that's what's up for upstairs, though, too. Yeah, lot, so, I have a lot of junk, Yeah, though. you're right. You do. I have a lot of junk. This so might be, would you ever hang, better. like, your hunting gear and stuff like that on the yeah, wall? Yeah, you Boots? could. Easy, so yeah, easily. Maybe, like, a big Maybe this could closet. be, like, a, almost an outdoor drop zone for, like, the real dirty stuff. Yeah. So you don't even take your boots inside. You kick your boots off here. And that's for, like, normal coats, jackets, stuff like that. But this could be, like, winter boots and you know hunting bibs and stuff like that because okay. so, like essentially if it's gonna let's say it snows i can't keep all of it in the shop because i'm gonna be cold going to the shop so i can come out here walk in here get all dressed up and bundled then go shovel the driveway i think that could make more that sense. would be good and then when it's all snowy you don't go inside with the snowy stuff you just leave it in here and because we are a concrete floor but since this is like a zero your house is a zero entry which yeah. means if someone's in a wheelchair yep. they can get in this house it creates kind of a problem when you hose out your garage, yeah, for the drainage. but I've got a way to solve it. So see how this is all wood right here? Yep. We'll go outside and we'll take we'll take exterior siding, okay. like the six, seven inch concrete siding, yep. and we'll create that as a baseboard. Oh, nice. And then we'll caulk everything. So yeah, when yeah. you hose this out, yeah. it's not- You're not, you're not, you're not washing the, the drywall. The drywall. <laughs> you don't want yeah, to right. do that. No. So that way okay. you hose like off that. that room, it works. Now this is your dog kennel, Yeah. all this area. Um, and it, slo it slopes down, right? Yeah, you can feel it. Yeah, slipping. I can feel it. Yeah. All because right. we remember we had a hassle with if we wanted a garage drain in the country, we had to have a, our own septic system, yeah, not, which not was thousands of dollars. Yeah, so not, not worth it. We'll hose it out. But I think with this now, we can air condition this garage too. That's we, cool. Yeah. You know, for, for, are we making that a dog aminium warmer upstairs? I, I still think I'm going to try to keep, keep the dogs up there. Yes. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, but we, it wouldn't be bad to keep this just chilled, like not chilled, but like, you know, not 102 degrees. Right. Keep it at like 80, 75, 80 would be nice. Yeah. So what we summer. do is what we call a mini split. We can mount oh. one up here. Okay. We'll have a heated garage already for electric. Yeah. But yeah. this one could just be for air conditioned. So Got we it. would blow cool air in this area. So on a hundred degree day, this will probably be maybe 75 or Yeah, 80. that's perfect. They're so already- So you think mini split right there then, yeah. right? It's cool. Because that's the line. We're, we're limited on how far we can run. I think it's 80 some feet long. Uh, so when we put a mini split in, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the Freon line and all those lines, there's, there's a distance mm. that we maximize the travel. Got it. So we'll talk about that upstairs. Okay. But since we're doing something upstairs now, that affords us to put a second unit. Right now I see the dogs being up there, but they may not like it. Like right now I keep my dogs in the garage and just kind of have a little corner like this with like an AC unit. So it'd give us flexibility. Yeah. Or if the dogs, you know, they want to go upstairs or they don't want to go upstairs depending if it's summer or winter. But Well, if you're moving to a nicer house, why can't the dogs? Yeah, that's, that's what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, we got to upgrade the dogs yeah. too. So let's go, let's take a look upstairs. So right. We did this railing here, so it's, it's sturdy. Once the drywall and stuff goes on, that, that will It'll secure this. That yeah, it won't, nice. it won't rock. We're not gonna put carpet on these things. We might look at LVT, yeah. so that you can almost hose this thing off if you wanted yeah. to. Yeah, absolutely. So that is something we gotta figure out yet, which is right. not too, we'll put that on Macy's department. Yeah, Macy can figure that one out. This is, this is crazy. This, this is, is like crazy. a whole house up here. Yeah. This is we crazy. thought we were gonna have to add a step. This is nice, just having a landing. Yeah. So, Alex was able to work around that. Nice. We added an extra step down there. Yeah. Oh, here's, here's my book. So this is like the house Bible. The house so Bible. Bible. Everything about your house, everything we changed. So this is crazy. This, this is, is too big for our dogs. I think. I, I think the dogs could use this corner or yeah. that corner maybe. Or you need more dogs. Or I need more dogs, which yeah. is a good option. Yeah. So let's, oh, walk, let's walk through this. So I'll show you what I what we've got. So you've got some really nice. I think these are nine foot ceilings. Up yeah. here. Yeah, that's all. And they're all, uh, this is what we call trusses, is what I'm trying to okay. say. Okay, yeah. So we can't cut any of that stuff out. It's all, so Structural. what we have there is there. So yep. we don't, I don't think we need to do anything, but right here on the floor, we gotta find ways to get air conditioning and heat up here. Yeah. So one way we're thinking is if I do these mini splits, I can put them up in the ceiling. Mm, okay. We can get two on one head. Okay. So if we add one downstairs, that's three. Okay. So we need to add another one. So, so two and two. total. Since you added that room back there, we'll show you in a minute, that yeah. extra storage. That'll be yeah, yeah. climate controlled. Right, right. Nice. So right. if you're adding one, if it gets to three, you're better off adding four. So we, yeah. So <laughs> what's nice is these windows, and we got lucky on this, uh, I mean, because these open. So really? you have egress, so you get vent it, you get air. Uh, I, might, I might deer hunt from up here. Yeah, you're pretty sure as I could, could Actually, you? that's where I'm putting the animals, so maybe the other side. Oh yeah. Fresh and hunt, fresh and hunt route. Let's but. See, that one opens up. Yeah. yeah. So I, can, I can deer hunt from up here, this is pretty cool. I think you could. You would hunt with me if this was the blind, yeah, right? Yeah, if I could hang out in the duck the, the hunt blind. <laughs> this is the hunt blind, yeah, we got, the world's largest. This is where we're talking about putting your kitchen. Yeah. So maybe I need to put a, a, a chair here to shoot out this yeah, window. Yeah, shoot, a shooting chair. Yeah, look at this thing. This is cool. 
Oh, this was ooh, such a good ooh, call. That feels much better. There's a nice oh, breeze. Oh, we need that. It's hot, it's hot up here. With this so kitchen, kitchen right here, you're thinking, right? Right. So I drew some stuff on the floor. That that's like a bar stool, right? Okay. I would come this way. Yep. These little circles would represent your cooktop. Okay. And then the hood would go straight up. So yep. it would be good looking. Yeah. So when you do your cooking. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'd be filming you like right here. Okay. Is that way. Is that, and then you have to put blinds. We'll put blinds. Yeah, we'll put blinds. No big deal. But that way, it, that way you can see what I'm cooking rather than filming over the shoulder. Okay. That's a lot better. So I was thinking with the sink, it's kind of an awkward thing. We. So see how low this is? Yeah, this you need, you don't this talk, is you don't 30 inches, that. I believe. But we'll have to figure this one out. What's this a, what's this is too here? low for a kitchen counter and yeah. a sink, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was going to either put a, maybe a sink. The plan I we drew up put a lot of stuff over here. But I feel trying like to get I, close to the house, or does it matter? Yeah, I, I was trying to. I don't think it really matters. This okay. is weird. Uh, yeah, yeah it's, a a little, it's a little odd, yeah. It needs to be probably a sink somewhere over I say this corner's not bad. Not bad. And no. maybe the refrigerator at the other end. On the other end. Yeah. So I have to worry about headroom. So refrigerators, yeah. they're probably a little over six foot tall. Yeah. So heck, that would be. He might be a little what we come, What we do, a cabinet here, and then the refrigerator jumps up and comes down, and then the sink. And then the sink. So we need to look at that. That yeah. would make a lot more sense. Yeah, I think the sink and the refrigerator, like that would be fine. Let me see. I don't I, see a problem with that. Um, let me show it. Let me just make a note. I'll hold that right there. Here's the world as we know it. Remember I said the sink was over here? Yep. That it should be either the, let me see. Here, here we go. Put the refrigerator here. Yep. Let's move the sink. On that side. To there. Yep. Move it. That would make sense. And leave this, just take this out. Yeah. We'll find something to put there. Right. So all your need is, uh, here's your sink. This will be a little, it says a bench. But it might be just another countertop a little lower. Yeah, okay. You're not gonna sit in no. the kitchen. No, we can figure something out though. Yeah. So and if you needed more, I don't know. Cabinets are expensive. Cabinets are expensive, and I don't think we need a ton. Yeah, you're just gonna cook. Let's say if we've got storage under here for all the pots and pans, is yeah, that what you're thinking? Yeah, like yeah. kind of like a big island with storage. Yeah, and then I can put a dishwasher here. I don't know. You guys aren't, you know, you know. You gonna wash dishes up here? Uh, yeah, I, I mean, oh. I, it, how, it depends how expensive it is yeah, well, it, to add. <clears throat> I cook in a garage right now, so anything yeah, is, is, is an upgrade. upgrade so that. you just tell okay. me. Well, this is good. I think this is gone. Okay. We do not need that. Yep. And then we'll have a nice big hood, which will look cool over yep. here. Love it. But the next thing we need to talk about is this bathroom. I've been, uh, the viewers are really big. They, they were adamant. Yeah. I, I said, we don't need a shower. I don't smell that bad. Everyone disagreed with that statement. <laughs> they, everyone said you need a shower. You need a shower. Need a shower. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to shower all the time and you need a shower to shower in. Yeah, exactly. So let's, uh, let's walk over here okay. and take a look. I have yeah. some ideas and I've drawn some stuff on the floor. Let's see okay. if I can figure this out. Because right. I agree with them. I think if you're going to have Vic guests and some other you YouTubers and Googan boys showing up here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, this... This is a studio apartment. This, this place is at huge. this point. Yeah, it is. Fifteen hundred square foot of studio. So it's like it adds square footage to the house. And it, as for resale, whenever that would be down the road, it's got its own little in-law suite. Exactly. Which everyone needs one of those. So the ceiling issue again. So what I thought. See how wide this room is. Um, what I think we could do. You grab my marker. Is put the shower. Because the shower again is uh, about six foot tall, and I think I marked on the floor. You know, hit your head. You'll be like, well, it's six foot. So, five. worst case, you, you start the shower here, and then it goes, it goes over this it goes way, up. right? Got it. And another thing I could do, since you have this dead space, remember on your downstairs, I took a pan and I built a little seat. So let's yeah. say you're in the shower, you could do this. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And then you stand up. You're not going to. So you, you can maximize the space. Yep, got it. You can do a four foot shower. Okay. We buy a 36 inch pan. Those are very inexpensive. Yep. Don't and then you're saying pull it this way and yeah. then build up the bench on that side. Yeah, we right? can even pull it out a little bit. So we'll come in and when yep. you open up the door, you see that vanity. So walk in. See the vanity. Walk in, wash turn, your hands. Put the toilet down there. Go over here. Toilet. Toilet. And then walk in here. Walk, step up here and shower. shower. Yes. I'm in. All the viewers are happy. Everyone needs to said I need a shower. So yeah. we're, we're listening to you guys. Okay. So you guys are just as good at spending my money as Brad and my wife and Banjo. <laughs> and banjo. I don't need any more. All right. We're at, we're at capacity. We need someone that can come up with some great cost saving ideas. Yeah, we need cost saving. Yeah, yeah. but so that, that's what, no fun. What are you thinking down here? So now, I mean, you see that little wall that's right here. I'll put the ladder where it's at. It doesn't even make a dent in the size of this room, right? So imagine that being the wall. Yep. There's your kitchen. 
Then you have your TV on that wall. Okay. And how much do you need down here for a uh, office, studio? Yeah, I bet we have a bedroom of some sort, probably. Bedrooms are 12 foot. 12. I want to just past this window, because you're going to want that window in this space. In the bedroom. Here's 12 foot, but we got to get to this wall. So yeah, why don't we... If we you want the 14. Okay. Oh, I see, yeah. So that's 14, and I don't know, I think it's monstrous. And then yeah. this becomes all living room. Yeah, I'm good with that. I think that's good. I mean, I'm thinking... Obviously, yeah, some type of bed, little Murphy bed or hide a bed of some sort. Because okay. it's not going to be used a lot, but you know, it could be there. And then, you know, all the camera gear. The, this could be like an office. If I do like a podcast or something, it could go in here. This is the YouTube man cave. So okay. we like Macy has no say in this. We make this as cool as we want. Okay. Because yeah. I already got screwed on the the man cave down in the basement. It's now the oh, children's yeah. museum. Oh yeah, that's a children's museum. So I said, You're, that, that's it. I get the loft. And she <laughs> okay. said, okay. All right. That's all she, she she kept. She tried to just li limit me to the storage or a space over there. But I said, just give me the loft. She said, okay, okay. We can make it as cool as one. We could reclaim wood. It. We could make it as like man cave. Yeah, all, right. all my mounts can go in here. I like this. This can be sweet. Yeah. Okay. No wife opinion oh. on this. No offense. And then if somebody does stay up here, it's going to be just them by themselves most yeah, likely. Yeah, 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 right. for sure. Okay, well, we'll consider. We can think on, we can think on that, but yeah. I think, this, this I think is your sizing is good. We'll just figure out how to, how to, what right. to put in here. All but right. this is good. I got that. So 14, 14 foot. 14 foot there. And then the rest of it's kitchen, living room, hangout. Maybe a pool table. Ooh, yeah, so you, got, you could. We have an elevator table. to get it up, so yeah, right. no problem there. So yeah, you, this could be the pool table could easily go right in here and yeah. in your living room. Yeah. Oh, now we're talking. Now we're talking. This yeah, is the pool table, game. ping pong table. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I want it all. All right. I have Big Buck Hunter, the arcade game too. You remember you played yeah, that? Yeah, I don't, that, it, I think it only works for you. Oh, uh, it I doesn't. See. It does. Yeah, well, you, we can bring that up here too. Yeah. All right, yeah. I need to practice. I don't know if you've been up and seen your storage room since no. this was storage dogs. Storage dogs. Dogs. Now we're into this. Thing. The dogs are still here. Storage over here. Oh yeah. Isn't this nice? Right. That was. We were filming your video when I came up with this idea. Remember that? When I was like, why don't we put something up there? Yeah, we poked up and, and everyone, saw. And everyone's like, don't do that. Look at this. This but looks great. You did all, well. This attic is huge. It's massive. Yeah. Yeah. So we do have a window, which yep. we'll be able to borrow some light through. But yep. The next thing is, uh, well, here's your elevator, and we do have to make a few changes. But this is where the elevator will come up, and, nice. and you'll dump everything into this side. Yep. It's a. We can't yeah. go both ways, but that's a bathroom. No, we so. don't need to do both no. ways. This is, I'm just thinking like I have all those, you know, everyone's got Christmas light totes, but those black totes, all you, you could stack them all the way up about five feet tall and just bring them right there. And then you just have banjo unloading them and we could do it nice yeah. and fast. You can put banjo's bed right there. Yeah, right? he can sleep here. That's where you're saying banjo could live here because here's my idea is that if we're air conditioning the dogs downstairs, yep. that extra head that we can put in can go in this space. So ah. otherwise, you come up here in the summertime, it's going to be 150 degrees. Yeah. Wintertime, it's freezing, so yeah, there's no yeah. insulation. Yeah. So the next thing, which we can spend some more of your money, but we're sure we'll, we'll take it out of the dumpster. Okay. We'll dumpster dive. Uh, yeah, we like got to get some two by fours and sixes. Extend. This is a temporary wall to keep you from falling in. Okay. So, well, let's just take this one all the way up. Yeah. Frame it and in. Frame it in, and we'll insulate it. Yeah. We don't have to add electrical. Or, I mean, we'll put a couple outlets. No. Yeah. We don't need just much. lights. Yeah. And 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 heat and cool this room. Okay. I like so it. So everything stays nice. Yeah. In there. Yeah. This is crazy. So we're we're standing over. We're on top of what your is that? laundry. That's the laundry room. room. Laundry and then that's room. the pantry. Yep. So well, I told not, you guys it was a good idea. This is great. Yeah, it's not like you're on top of the master bedroom tromping around. No, okay. this is actually a cl yeah, closet and a mudroom beneath us. Yeah. So a bunch of storage. Right. I like so, it. That's good. Uh, the heating air guys were asking me. They're waiting to hear what we should do with this space. So okay. you're okay with making this a yeah. Heat and cool. Heat and cool, yeah. I mean, if it's not, you're not going to want to use it. No. The wife's going to say, go pick that up in the attic. And you're going to say, I'll do it at midnight when it's not super hot. What's right. the point? Yeah. So. And now it's... Uh, Frame it in, and who knows? You could turn this into the children's museum. Let's put, let's move it up here. Yeah, maybe yeah. I, maybe I give Macy this, and then I get the basement back. Exactly. We got. There's got to be a compromise somewhere. somewhere. I just keep I just keep losing. You do. So we got a little tiny step. Now we're back over the garage. Right, sir. So okay. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Where's some of the garage over there? That. Okay. What? Uh, I don't know. We're gonna look around the outside, see if the siding, just anything. I don't. We may have already gone over all that. we the stone guys are supposed to start here in a couple weeks because. We went with the super-sized uh, water table that sits on top of the stone. It's, you know, most is this year's, yours is triple the size. So, Got it. Uh, hey, here comes Macy. Oh, oh is she oh, here? Yeah. She's coming in around the, the wife, corner. Oh, the wife is here. All right. Make her she go know how to get the, in? I don't, she wants to climb through the bat window. Yeah. Like NASCAR. Macy, here. Who is it? We don't have, you have to have a special uh, ratchet. Did you get through? Okay. Yeah. Climbing through the window. It's like, 
Kind of like, kind of like a NASCAR. I mean, you climb. You don't have it over the door, but you gotta go through the window. Yeah, you gotta go through yeah. the window. Um, so we've. Uh, we uh, said you don't have any opinion on the man cave. Is that true? You got oh. voted out because you took the you took the basement. It was the children's museum now. And so I said, then she doesn't get a say on the man cave because she took our sports court. So you're going to design it? You're going to pick out cabinets? Brad and I got it. Can I help him? Brad, Brad, no, 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 you and me. No, <laughs> you're on my team. What the hell? Man cave. Yeah. Man I, cave. I saw her look on her face when you said, I get the man cave all to yourself to do what you want. And like, that, that was like huh. a deer in the headlights. That's scary. <laughs> so we've um, made none of the changes that affected you. By the way, they, they're, the plumbing... People are calling me, go, when can we get rid of your 700 pound tub? They want me to take it. I don't know where to put it in this place. How do you move a 700 pound tub? Yeah, around you only moved that one you time. Only one time. I, I'm wondering if we uh, buy like a shipping container and we have could. it out here that we can store it. Store stuff or in Or do we put it up in that? Can you pick it up with a forklift, like a skid loader? I would think so. Oh, yeah. I, I can find a spot for it then. So let, let's think about yeah, where we're it somewhere close to the house because wherever we're going. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. they're saying, you need to get it in the house before you start putting on doors. Well, those can open up. Yeah. We might have to. Sorry. <laughs> so, I don't know how wide she gets it. The first thing was a tub, and then I don't even know what was next. And then she took the basement and went, we're getting the man yeah, cave. The children, where did you come up with the children's museum? I like that idea. Isn't that fun? I, mean, I said he's the mayor. He's things. the mayor of the town, though. Yeah, he I'll has be, to. What be. does that I'm, make you then? I'm, a, I'm the mayor of who? Of uh, Flairville. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that's it. So um, yeah, we walked through, I showed Andrew the nano wall and all that. Your stone should be coming, uh, hopefully awesome. in the next week. Oh, wow. What I have to do to get the stone guys jump started is that I have to build a mock wood uh, with your stone that comes up, then it's what mm -hmm. they call a water table. And I was just telling Andrew, some are like two inches thick. I think yours is like five or six. <laughs> so I have to build a wood trim all the way around. So those stone up to it, will pull that wood off and we're waiting for that stone uh, to be fabricated. Got it. So yeah. I don't, said, I, let's find a way to keep things moving. Yeah, and yeah. That's one way to do that. Okay. Yeah. We'll yeah, just take we more stuff out of the dumpster. Custom yeah. blend of stone and then a custom grout color, I think. <laughs> what is the word custom? Just roll always. right off her tongue. I always. Yeah. It has to be. Yeah, nothing custom. factory, yeah. nothing yeah. standard. Yeah. It's all imported from yeah. Germany or yeah. something. <laughs> well, you wait. When this house is done, it's these guys, you're going to. You're gonna love it. And I hope they're so. gonna love it. So I hope so. We're never it's moving. A, never, <laughs> never. I know. You don't have to move anywhere. Exactly. Okay, I just wrapped up everything with Andrew and Macy. Everything's looking good at the house. It was nice walking through and uh, also having Macy there to keep Andrew in check. This is the first time I think I've had a meeting with him where Andrew has not added something to the house. So that will help get me back on schedule and um, get things moving forward. I don't even know if he understood my, uh, it seemed like he didn't really like my washboard for some reason. I thought it was a great gift, especially for a flare. Okay, so with that, I have to fine tune some stuff upstairs and uh, Flair did pay attention to what you guys said. We're definitely adding that shower in the uh, upstairs bathroom so i'll get that changed that's a great addition and we do listen to you guys so thanks for commenting i really appreciate you watching and i'm off to the next job site